Richard Tice. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. Will the Secretary of State actually, who's obsessed with renewable energy, be honest with the British people? Here's Reform MP Richard Tice going on about renewable energy and the costs it will incur on the general public, as if he cares about his constituents. It's interesting that 90% of reform donations come from fossil fuel groups and climate deniers. I wonder if he's really, then, looking out for his donors. Hmm. Because the truth is that the offshore wind turbines bid today are some 20% above current prices. The floating offshore wind is some three times the current prices. His own department, Madam Deputy Speaker, say that actually this requires subsidies of some £1.5 billion a year. That's before the extra transmission costs, before the constraint payments, before the compensation payments for blighting the countryside of my constituents, and before the cost of backup when the wind doesn't blow and the sun doesn't shine. So why would the Secretary of State be honest and tell the truth that renewable energy is more expensive, not cheaper? Secretary of State. I have to say that I'm interested in the uh, Honourable Gentleman's intervention because his manifesto is basically for higher bills and to make people poorer. Uh, and, 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 you don't, and you don't need to look into the crystal ball. You just need to look at the record because the truth is that the cost of living crisis, the energy bills crisis, casts a long shadow in this country. And the energy bills crisis was not caused by our dependence on renewables. It was caused by our exposure to fossil fuels. And he just needs to understand this very basic point, which is that whether fossil fuels are produced in this country or internationally, they are sold on the international market. And that's why, and that's why the British people paid the price and government forked out £94 billion. Pounds. And the only, way, the only way to get off the roller coaster of international gas markets and take back control <laughs> is to become a clean energy superpower. Joni Reid. Click here for Lee versus Ed and right versus left.